this is Allie Edwards and I am here today to introduce you to our brand new One Little Word journal. A few, years, a few years ago we offered a One Little Word journal that had was smaller and it had some uh, journaling ideas to connect with your word and then a bunch of blank pages. And this year we have basically reimagined that idea uh, with design help from our friend Liz Tominaha of Paisley Press to give you a month by month uh, journal which can either work on its own or be an awesome companion to the One Little Word workshop. This is definitely not something that you have to have if you're taking the workshop. One of the requests that we've had over the years is that people want to go deeper or they want an opportunity to do a little bit more with their word outside of the um, once a month creative prompts that come along with the workshop. So our hope is is that this can be a great way to deepen your relationship um, if you're taking the class or it can just be another way to experience your word this year regardless of, of the other options that you're taking. So let's go ahead and take a look inside the journal itself. Starts obviously with a little message from me and then there is a table of contents and each month uh, as you will see, includes a two-page calendar spread um, and an opportunity for a monthly reflection. And then there's one or two prompts for each month that you are invited to respond to. So here, this one says, my one little word is... And then we come in and there's a few things in the beginning where you can do a vision board that can just be a small vision board. Those of you that have taken uh, the One Little Word workshop, we usually do a large version of the vision board. So this kind of walks you through a couple ideas about that. There is a monthly self-portrait section where you can add in photos of yourself each month. And there's also a spread for monthly intention. So this is a great way to kind of organize those ideas and be able to see it all at once versus the individual uh, ways that we approach intentions in the workshop. We've got some quotes here that separate some of the uh, sections. And then here is what you're gonna see for each month. So you'll, so you'll get a full calendar spread. You can add in the numbers for the actual dates and then each month has a section where you can put in some sort of an image it has this month's goals it has reflections and notes and then months or wins excuse me for the month itself and then as you go into the month there will be one or two creative prompts so the one for january is actually revisiting previous words so that is um, the the direct prompt for you and there's a couple different um, spreads for that depending on how often or how long you've been participating in the projects. So that's the one for January. And then we move into February. It's got the calendar again. It's got the goals, the reflections. And then in, in February, the, the creative prompt there is companion words, um, inviting you to kind of explore what other words are coming up for you. And then there's also a section for opposites, kind of thinking about the opposite of your word um, and how do both exist in your life. So that's kind of a a look that's just an initial look at the different kinds of things that you're going to see in each month and they're going to be different throughout the whole year here's march march um, uses a prompt that i've used once in the work or a couple times in the workshop previously where you have someone else interview you um, or you interview someone else about how they see your word working in your life so that's kind of a good example of those kind of of, of prompts that you're going to see again different for each month out of the year so that goes through the full month there uh, and then we flip to the back and in the back um, for December we obviously have um, a, a yearly reflection section there kind of a, a, over the whole year as well as just some blank pages in the back with a with a really fine dot pattern where you could add in a few other things we are super excited about this product as an opportunity for people to have a different experience uh, with their word to give you a spot to really connect with it on a deeper level and, and give you something else to do if you're wanting additional um, things to think about over the course of the month. So if you have any questions, please let me know. I'm happy to answer them for you below.